Lord says to you, Be proud of what you have achieved. You deserve to give yourself a big pat on the back, for you have certainly earned it. You have come so far from when you first started. Dear God, give me I am worthy energy. Give me I am powerful energy. Give me I have what it takes energy. Give me the magic is within me energy. Give me I know I can energy. Give me I was made for this energy. Give me I belong here energy. Give me worth it energy. Give me I am limitless energy. Give me I'm destined to soar energy. Give me I can and I will energy. Give me I believe in me energy. Give me I've got this energy. Keep me I am strong energy. Give me I am capable energy. Give me I'm just getting started energy. Give me my time is now energy. Give me the universe has my back energy. Give me I trust my path energy. Give me under one energy. Give me I am made of stars energy. Give me my light shines brightly energy. Give me nothing is impossible energy. Give me more than enough energy. If there's a fire in your heart and a dream you just can't shake, give it the energy of wholeheartedly knowing this dream is meant for me. I never understood the feeling that took birth inside me every time I lost someone in life. It was an ache. I knew that. An emptiness. I knew that too. But only emptiness couldn't feel that heavy, could it? It had to be more, and it had to have a name. A few years later, when I met someone who seemed to care about me, I felt powerful. Powerful, because I knew that I mattered, and with that power also came weakness. That's when I finally found a name for what I felt with loss. It was weakness. Weakness, because I had no safety net, no life jacket, and no power. I was just a body without strength. I was meek, powerless. And then, as time passed, I kept feeling powerful, and I kept falling weak until I realized that my power didn't come from feeling loved. It came from loving. It came from giving. And weakness didn't come from abandonment either. It came from fear. It came from distance. Everything was about me wanting to feel secure, protected, loved, and accepted, and not about securing, protecting, loving, and accepting my own self. It was always about escaping and hiding and passing responsibility, and never about being my own escape, my own safety, and my own responsibility. I learned it the hard way, and it's true that power does not come from the people around us, and neither does it leave with them. It comes from the force within us, and it's always there, stronger when we hardly feel it. Safety nets and life jackets are for those who can't swim, but darling, you and I have survived a whole damn storm. Remember, Angel? As a kid, I'd always wished to be on a page in someone else's scrapbook. As a teen, I wished to be someone people would borrow notes from to take back home. In college, I wished to be a contact number on someone's phone. As a young man, I wished to be on the list of a few close friends they invite to celebrate milestones. When I grow older, I'd wish to be the one they choose to take for parent-teacher meetups. Type yes, if you believe in God. God bless you.